皆さん、こんにちは。お元気ですか Hello everybody, how are you doing? Today, we're going to study how to indicate possession in Japanese. To indicate ownership in Japanese is very simple and easy to understand. But before we start, let's review the main Japanese pronouns. How to say I, you, he, and she. I, watashi, watashi. You, anata, anata. He, kare, kare. And she, kanojo, kanojo. Now, how do we indicate possession? To indicate possession, we simply add the particle no after the pronouns. The particle no, to indicate possession. Watashi plus the particle no. Now it is watashi no. Watashi no means my. Anata plus the particle no. Anata no means your. Anata no. And kare no, his. Kanojo plus the particle no. Kanojo no, her. Kare no, kanojo no. Knowing how to indicate ownership in Japanese can help you in many different situations. Here are some examples how to indicate ownership in Japanese. How do you say my wallet? You can say like this. Watashi no my saifu. Watashi no saifu. My wallet. Another example. How do you say your bag in Japanese? You say anata no your kaban. Anata no kaban. Your bag. Anata no kaban. And what about his cell phone? Kare no sumaho. Kare no sumaho. His cell phone. The rule is very simple. First we say the pronoun indicate ownership and then we say the object. So, did you like it? If you want to know more things related to Japanese language, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to our channel. Mitte kurete arigatou gozaimashita. Thanks for watching.